Yo, what's up you guys? It's Gossip Dudes. Welcome back, bro, to Clash of Clans. Dudes, it's finally happened. I'm here inside of the No Walls Clan. This is where all of the members have no walls. Well, except me. I'm the only one with walls here, but uh, check this out. We'll just go to like, um, check this out. We'll just find a guy and use like every clan member has no walls in here. It's just insane. And uh, I believe it goes to the Town Hall 11. You'll find all these guys around the Town Hall 11 area and they don't have walls here. So let's like just take out the top guys here. Yeah, there it is. And you know, the funny thing is dudes, they have posted some replays down below that I'm gonna be showing you. And uh, they're actually winning in some of these defenses, <laughs> believe it or not. With no walls, I mean, uh, yeah, it is tough, but if you have uh, some strong weapons that are maxed for that, you know, Town Hall 11, it's possible. So, in today's episode, we're going to be checking out this clan. Big shout out to them for letting me in. I was kind of like worried they wouldn't do it, but uh, they did, and now I'm able to cover this. I just have to be, oh, look at this. This guy has like literally nothing in this uh, this town hall. He's just got Teslas. <laughs> There's no weapons. Um, okay, so this clan literally um, allowed me in. Thankfully, I'm an outsider with walls here. And uh, we're going to try and cover some of this stuff. So check it out. They posted some of their defenses here. Let's see how they win this. Oh, I always win. <laughs> okay, check it. Let's see. Uh, oh, this is nice. It's a... Uh, it's a goblin challenge. Okay, check this. <laughs> they came in with all goblins. Very nice. I'm guessing this is what you're going to find um, down here in his level. He's like in the, um, the silver. Uh, rage and goblin. <laughs> okay. They're in it. Can they take out the town hall? Wow, they did. Oh, but it's just a one star. Very nice attack. Very cool. Okay, so that was nice. Let's see the second attack here. Oh, it's a one star. Oh, but this is the attacker. Ah, all super goblins. Nice. This is how you... But do they even need it? I mean, uh, <laughs> these guys are max... These guys are like town hall 11, and that's the max you can go with... If you try to go to the next level, then... Um, you're going to be forced to get walls. So these guys really, it's out. It sucks unless you have a second account, but they're stuck <laughs> at a town hall 11. And thankfully supercell allows, you know, super troops and everything for town hall 11s so that they can have fun with that. But as long as supercell is, um, using some troops for their updates so that these guys can have fun with, fun with them and any new troop that comes out that's a plus otherwise it might get pretty boring with them st uh, stuck at whatever they have oh nice here they go grand warden pop the ability dude that's awesome <laughs> very nice all right i don't need wall okay and the clan did post some of the replays here and this is actually funny because um after watching this I have a better appreciation of clans um, or town halls without walls. As you guys can see, the buildings are positioned in such a way where um, this this allows the troops to go around the town hall so that they can't get the two star. Well, let's see how they do it here. We got a team full of super barbs. Check it out. This is actually nice. It kind of makes me think, like, what would happen if Supercell actually made this game without walls? It would kind of be like this. The buildings would try to, uh, the buildings would be pulling some of the troops away from the town hall. But of course, we have funneling. Yeah, we've got that down. But adding walls is just another mechanic to the game. Let's check this out, guys. He's struggling to get to the town hall. They're very close. But alas, all the troops kind of went around the town hall because of the way it's uh, designed. It's like a merry-go-round base. And so this is basically what you will see with town halls that don't have walls. They're trying to like 
put everything around in a circle around the base so that they can't get to the town hall. And the power weapons are towards the middle. Very nice. I really liked it. Let's see one more here. Oh gosh, it's a down hall nine. All right, so skeleton spells are there. That's pretty cool. They could use the skeleton spells and the invisible spell at a town hall. Um, what is this town hall button? Whoa! Look at the the skeletons are having a hard time getting the town hall. Dude. There we go. Thank goodness there's no uh, splash weapon. <laughs> they probably could take it. Look at it taking so long. Imagine that. Like if uh, Supercell actually made like uh, an animation of this. These guys are taking forever just to take down the town hall. Ooh, and there goes, there goes the splash damage. Oh! He's forced to use the troops. Couldn't do it with uh, his skeletons. Dang, these clan count troops are destroying everything. That's pretty good defense. All right, here they come. This would have been funny if it was a one star. It was nice defense. Dude, that's like nice defense for a Town Hall 9 to go walls. But they got flooded. Good stuff. Good stuff. And this is the last one here, guys. This is just having fun with Town Halls with no walls. I can only imagine how old um, these accounts are for this to be, you know, a thing so that they have this without having any walls. It's pretty cool to see, and I'm glad I'm inside of this clan. Um, I will be covering their war, or at least trying to. Uh, I'm trying to get to elder status, and once I get elder, I'll be able to check out their war, but right now I'm just a member, so I'm spectating. So, dudes, that's pretty much uh, the clan, no walls, how they attack with no walls. It's a different, you know, a whole different scenario. When you don't have walls, you have to, you know, lay out your base in such a way so that um, they can't get to the town hall whereas you know some of the other bases with walls they put their town halls towards the edge of the map but that was the old meta so now it's different of course but it's just nice to see this clan i will be covering more of it so thank you guys so much for watching this is godson be sure to check me out on the next episode and i will see you there godson out